Hello and welcome to another Listen to Mailbag. I am, as always, Steven. So today, we're going to talk about the movie Bloodshot. I watched it. Uh, well, I watched part of it Sunday, part of it Monday. Um, It stars Vin Diesel and it takes its story from the Bloodshot line of comics from Valiant. And I have to say, I started watching it with the old lady. She was not amused. And she usually likes comic book movies. But she said she'd give it a try again some other time. Uh, but I think... Okay, first of all, it's an okay movie. You should check it out and judge for yourself. I mean... Yeah, that's about all I can say. Uh, the beginning does start off relatively slow. And speaking of relatively slow, does Vin Diesel have it in his contract that in every movie he has to have at least one scene wearing a white wife beater? I mean, come on. Uh... If you watch a Vin Diesel movie, you're like 99% guaranteed he's going to have a scene where he's wearing a wife beater. Probably show off his muscles because he's a man. Not really. Anyway, the movie does start off kind of slow, in my opinion. And uh, there's really not a lot of action. True, you do see him, like, shoot some people and stuff. But for the most part, it's slow as fuck uh, in the beginning. However, uh, about midway, two-thirds of the way in, is where the action starts. And that's where uh, the movie seems to excel. Uh, especially the fight scene, well, it's the last fight scene, uh, they're like, it's, uh, Bloodshot, the dude with no eyes, and the guy wearing an exos, and he's, it's kind of like an exosuit, it's a backpack with big, giant robot arms, are having a fight down an elevator shaft. It's a fairly good scene. And, uh, in my opinion, it is what made the movie. The rest of the movie, who gives a shit? Just, like, fast forward to the end of the movie. That last fight sequence. Because that's really the most action in there. Now, I understand the beginning would be slow. Because, like, this is an origin movie. So you gotta find out how he becomes bloodshot and stuff. But, they probably could have done a more abbreviated version of that and got uh, more into an action-packed movie, which is what you would think it would have been. But like I said, overall, it's an okay movie. Will I watch it again? Yes, because I spent $20 on this fucking turd. So of course I'm going to watch it again. Shit, I've watched Green Hornet. Several times. And I fucking hate that movie. Fucking hate it. Anyway, go check it out. Tell us what you thought in the comment section below. How did you like Bloodshot? And do you think Vin Diesel has it in his contract that he must wear a wife beater in one, at least one scene in every movie he's in? So until next time, see you later.